probably look in absolute state. And it's because I'm just after waking up and it's 4.30 and I don't want to wake everyone in the house up. So if you can hear me, great. If you can't, I don't care. So I'm getting my first meal in now. Then I'm going to go back to bed and then go again with another, with another meal in about two to three hours. Here, it's just 80 grams of oats, 20 grams of dark chocolate, protein and bananas. I'm going to have a bit of water, I'm going to have a small bit of water, some salt, just throw, throw it back. Yeah. Not sure if you can see me there. It is 6 o'clock in the morning, after spending the last hour my mother, legend, over there, got up, put the tan, top coat of tan on me. So that's three three coats now, and then me and Keen will probably top each other up again when we get down to the venue. So next now is to get dressed in loose clothes and meet the guys and meet the guys in about an hour in town and then have the next meal at about half seven. Oh, you puller, man. Puller, say, let's go, big D. One, two, three. <laughs> Brandon, how are you feeling? Jesus, man. It's, it's, that is a very close. <laughs> oh, it's I'm feeling good, yeah. I'm feeling good. Oh, he's ready. I'm excited. Is that all you have? You're keeping it short today? Yeah, no, I'm keeping it short today. Yeah, I spoke too much, so that's it. No, I'm excited, Jared. <laughs> Good. You look good. Thirsty, man. I'd say so. Very thirsty, man. How are you, Ringer, man? You haven't featured in a while. No cameras, please. <laughs> Brendan. I've never been featured. <laughs> this is Brendan Wells. Sorry, lads. You think you've seen him before, but. But that's. You think it's that man there. It's not Kevin. He's not two places at once. <laughs> and he hits. We rolling. All right, just registered in the Everyman is the name of the theater. Go on, Everyman. Go on, Everyman. Me and Monk just registered. He's there in the back. So fucker. All the boys are here. The great crew of uh, support here today. Pulley's there. Let's go, Big D. <laughs> Dead right. Okay, let's see. Yeah, we've great support here today. The fam coming down as well. And that's what's important about today. It's not the trophy itself, it's not the five euro trophy, it's all these fuckers here with me and Monk. Together. Go away, Mayo. <laughs> <laughs> They'll do it this year. <laughs> <laughs> I know, we just got our last coat of tan on. Me, Brennan, Ring went into the toilet and rubbed each other in the toilet. Tan Let me on. put the tan on after that. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, we were chilling out the car, me and Puller were having a lovely nap before the fucking wank came and woke us up. That's how it goes, it's life. And yeah, we're ready to go. Let's go Big D. Right, we're here, it's show day. Um, it's about two hours until I step on stage, just here in the car chilling with the boys. Big D. Let's go Big D. Let's go Big D. The Puller. Let's go Big D. B. And we got Brendan and my brother in the background. So yeah, pretty pretty excited. Um, all the hard work is done now. The tan is on. All the coats are done. First two meals are had. Uh, I'm just going to meet with my coach in a couple of minutes, and he's going to see exactly how I'm looking and tell me if I need more carbs or if I need water or what's what's the story. He's going to tell me the plan. So looking forward to that. And like I said, excited and ready to ready to smash it. Go big deep. Come to the ring. What's up? This is future big D. Well, present big D. Just want to give a quick little overview of what's happening here. This is the first time that we stepped on stage, all of us, everyone together. And as we're posing away here, I don't think here I was doing myself 
any justice. Uh, wasn't posing too good at this point. Nerves, I was pretty nervous at the start. As you can see, I actually stumbled a bit there. But um, yeah, and then after we're finished doing our polls here, we all go back in line and then they call out the top six in which they uh, felt looked the best. And as you'll see, when they put everyone back and they call out the top six, that I'm actually the last one to get called. So I was literally like, fuck. Like, don't tell me like they're not really rating me. Um, but then they start seeing that my physique is pretty good and then I start moving along the line. And um, yeah, then I fucking snap out of this fucking bitch and like, come on, Big D, own this shit. Competitor 18. Competitor 26. Yeah, go Big D. To the back competitors to show. So it was a 26 and 127 swap bases. From to your right. Let's go, Big D. Come on, turn to your right. Yes, Dave. 26. Come on, turn to your right. Come on, turn to your right. Twenty three and eighteen spot places. Uh, you just move your hand from the number there to set up the James and the Okay you guys, once more. One to turn to your right. One to turn to your right. Well done, Dave. Okay, guys, awesome stuff. Judges are happy. Step back off the side of the stage. Good job, Dave. Well done. Well done. Well done. I actually felt pretty bad for this dude as we weren't told we were doing a single tea walk on our own at all prior to the show. So he came out, wasn't really, he was expecting all of us to line up and didn't really know what was going on. Peter, you need to do your posing routine, so. So yeah, with us all backstage seeing what happened, we had time to gather ourselves basically. And I think everyone just went out and did their posing routine. Um, but yeah, I felt pretty bad for that guy. It was unfortunate that that had to happen. So yeah, the rest of us just went out and killed it.
Okay, the third place is number 27, Patrick Hall. Okay, in second place is number 26, David Chakasi. Well done, Dave. Well done, Dave. Good job, Dave. Good job, Dave. Go, Big D. Well done, David. Okay, and in first place, number 22, Ross <laughs> Stuff. Well done. Alright guys at the back, thanks very much, appreciate it, well done. Right, don't blame me for the footage that you're seeing of Keen. This is all he sent me to put up. He can't work, he basically can't even technology. So this is his fault, okay? Work with it, deal with it. Not my problem. Also, this here is Keane's uh, single posing routine, him himself. He was posing to The Weeknd adaptation. What a tune, great tune. So why am I doing a voiceover? Because I'll probably get copyrighted and won't be able to put up the video. Sorry, Keen. Great tune, though. Check it out. All right, we've all the boys here in the back and in the front. Sum it up. Robbery. Fuck the cunts. Fuck the NBFI. I'm calling you. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> no, at least go with me or we're going to win the All Ireland this year. No, um, Brennan. Brennan got robbed. That's not biased. Still have my banker though. <laughs> he got robbed. They took his flip flops. The fringe is still intact. But no, he came second and he should have, he got first. Um, I placed second, which was less of a robbery, I think. I think he probably did deserve it over me. It's debatable. It's debatable, it's subjective, but that's how it goes. But the two of us are coming home with two second place trophies. It's a great job. Not really. Fuck it. Green man, green. Uh, let's go, Big D.